Let us show you how to set up SaaS Bubble CPAP mode. You primarily need five components to use SaaS in Bubble CPAP mode. SaaS device, bubble jar, O2 connected tube, the consumables packet, humidifier and temperature probes. First, make sure the SaaS device is mounted on trolley or placed on a stable flat surface and make sure that all the above mentioned components are easily reachable. Now carefully open the SaaS Bubble CPAP consumables packet. You will find the following components there. The water chamber, humidifier limb, dual limb heated wire circuit, RAM scannula. Turn the SaaS device around to see the oxygen tube connecting port and carefully connect the tube to the device by pushing it in. Gently lift the ring above the port to disconnect the oxygen cable. Now move on to the humidifier setup. Connect the blue cable or the temperature probe to the temperature probe socket. Make sure to align the probe properly. Be extremely careful with the other end of the blue cable. It is very sensitive to force and can break easily. Connect the yellow cable or the heating probe to the heater wire socket. Insert the water chamber by sliding it onto the humidifier. It is now secure inside the latch. The water chamber can be removed by pushing the latch down. Connect one end of the humidifier limb to the water chamber and the other to the patient output of SaaS device. Connect one limb of the dual heated wire circuit to the water chamber and the other to the bubble jar. Make sure that the water level is not above the line. You can adjust the pressure in the bubble jar by moving up and down the dipstick as shown here. The number above the jar signifies the set pressure, not the number below. After this is done, connect the RAM scannula to the other end of the dual limb circuit. Connect the pressure sampling tube to the device and make sure it's properly connected by gently pulling it. Connect the heated probe to the heated wire circuit near the water chamber. Connect the temperature probe to the heated wire limb near the patient's end. SAS device setup. Switch on the device by gently pushing the power button. Once the device is switched on, you will see the battery and available mode. Make sure the device is plugged in if the battery is below 30%. Use the knob to move to the bubble CPAP mode and gently press it to select. You can also change the values of flow and FiO2 by using the knob. Knob can be turned clockwise to increase and anti-clockwise to decrease the values. Use the dipstick and bubble jar to select the pressure you want to deliver. After you are satisfied with the values, select the start button to start the therapy. Give the device about 2 minutes to reach the set values. The device also provides visual information to compare the set and actual values. You can pause the therapy by pressing the pause button but rest assured that this doesn't turn off the device. It simply pauses the therapy. You can resume the therapy by pressing the resume button. The flow as well as FiO2 values can be edited using the modify button. To start a new therapy with the new values, press start again. To stop the therapy, press the stop button. Your SaaS device setup for bubble CPAP is now complete. Please feel free to contact InAxel at info at the rate inaxel.com or plus 9180409238644 for any assistance.